the first ingredient to any good cook. Folks. It's still winter time, so on a cold day, there's nothing better than a good chili. This is my recipe that I think that you would like a lot. So the first thing I have is I have some beautiful fresh cut vegetables. I have garlic, celery, cilantro, jalapenos, onions, and red bell peppers. And I also have some tomatoes. So I will put the exact quantities in the description below. Uh, so you need to get all these chopped up real nice. I got two cups of pre-cut uh, Pinto beans. I got some tomato sauce beef consomme my spices And I got about three pounds of uh, chili grind hamburger meat and of course you need some SA and some burnt beef so the first thing I'm going to do here is I'm going to uh, put a little bit of Burnt beef. I'm gonna I'm gonna put plenty of burnt beef on this on this meat because I don't want to. I'm not gonna be adding any later on, most likely. So just get some of that in there. Make sure you got plenty of burnt beef. That's plenty. We're gonna get that in there, and I'm gonna make this into a ball. Before, but before I get my hands all completely dirty, I'm gonna go ahead and add all these vegetables into my beautiful cast iron fine X. And what I'm going to do now is I'm gonna make this into just a, just a big ball of goodness. And now I'm gonna put this right on top of this cast iron pot. I'm gonna set both of them on the gateway drum. I'm gonna have that drum at about 400 degrees. And what it's going to do, it's going to uh, saute these vegetables a little bit. It's gonna smoke these after these vegetables saute. I'm going to add other stuff like uh, my beef consomme, my tomato sauce. And then after I add the meat, after the meat's cooked, then I'll add my beans, tomatoes, and my spices. We'll see you outside. Got this gateway drum, it's just under 400 degrees. Let everything do its thing. Well, here we go. This beautiful pot of chili is done. This Fine X is a great uh, cast iron cooker to have. We're going to go in here, get us a little bit. Try to get a little bit more juices. Now, before I finish this bowl, I'm going to add a little cheese. And I like plain pork rinds. 
I know you folks up north like to use saltine crackers. This is better. Check that out. It's got some beautiful colors. It's just a beautiful bowl of chili. Still pretty warm. It's gonna get a small bite so I don't burn the crap out of my mouth. Man, all those vegetables we put in there, along with the spices, especially these two spices, don't ever forget those. Married so well together. Got just the right amount of heat with those jalapenos. So must try. You guys have a great day. Don't let the smoke get too dark on you. Keep the smoke nice and light. Mm. Mmm. You can taste the smokiness. It's good. Mm-hmm.